I'm so sick of the cold. I'm ready for the spring to come in. Like, it's 31 degrees outside. Some people may say it's not that cold. I prefer the warmth. I'd rather be hot in a short sleeve than shivering in a car with cold hands and ears. Today's a different video. It's going to be quick. I hope everyone had a great Christmas because this is a video after Christmas. Today I'm installing some Alcantara. Sorry if the camera's shaky. I am freezing cold. Uh, but I'm installing more Alcantara. So remember the steering wheel. We got the Alcantara steering wheel, which is the GTS wheel. I didn't get the shift lights or anything because I didn't see the point of it because you got a shift light on the windshield and you have a shift light on the RPM. But let's go ahead and install more Alcantara. This Alcantara, what it's for is actually for, it's got car fiber on it too. It replaces this factory armrest and this handbrake and you'll go ahead, it'll be carbon fiber slash Alcantara. It looks way better. It has that blue red stitching on it with the M colors. And then once the rest of the stitching gets redone in the car, it's gonna look really good. But let's go ahead and I'm gonna try to do this as best as I can, film it as best as I can. I'm using my bigger lens because my smaller lens is like, it's having issues. I don't know what the deal is. I need to probably get a new camera pretty soon. This was like the first one I bought, which wasn't even that long ago, but I didn't know what I was buying and digging myself into. I'm using the Sony at the moment, but let's go ahead and try to figure out how I'm going to mount this camera up. I'm going to do the armrest first, which is pretty easy. I'm just going to go find some pliers in the Honda since the Honda has become my toolbox. So we'll go to the Honda, grab some pliers, and I hope I just don't break anything. The goal is not to break anything, so let's not do that. All right, I'm going to go to the Honda real quick. So the first thing you need to do is this actually slides, so it's floor and back. But then first thing we need to do is pop this back cover off, which should just snap right off. And you'll have some cords to disconnect from this power outlet. So it's just an easy snap. And then we have one more for this top. That's off. So you got two of those cords I just unplugged. Super easy, nothing difficult. Next thing you do is you need to pop that out. So let's go ahead and grab those pliers. Woo, okay. So now that's done. Should be able to pop these out. that to the side, put that one to the side, pull the spring up, and after other than that it should pop on out. Here's the new one, go ahead and unwrap that, and boom, oh it's so gorgeous. Alright, so if I slide this forward, you see that has the carbon fiber with the stitching. Here's the old one. It's just a boring old leather. So there's the before and there's the after.
Alright, so now that this part is on, that Atkins here is so pretty. Get that dirt off. Now that's on, we'll go ahead and install the back piece, which is just those two plugs. You plug it back in, and it slides right on. Just like that. This piece is on. Let's go ahead and take this to the front because I have one more piece. But now it's time to replace this and this with the carbon fiber. Now this we should be able to just pull out. Let's see where I can mount this camera. So here's the old one, it's just leather, looks very strange when it's off. So there's the old one, throw that out, here's the new one. So it's got that stitching, some carbon fiber, just looks so much better, more sporty. So all it does is just slide right on. Once that's on, you simply just push in all the pins. Woo! There she is. I'm genuinely pretty excited about this mod. It was something like I didn't know do or not. Cause it's Alcantara. As I love Alcantara. I like it way better than leather. I'm planning to do a lot, a lot more Alcantara in this car. The thing about Alcantara is it's not good for daily abuse. It does wear. The steering wheel will probably need to be replaced in 50,000 miles. Same with this thing. It wears off. And that's what sucks about it when there's things that you touch a lot. If it's like the roof, you don't have to worry about it. And I got the UV protected film over the windows. It won't fade. So when I do the ceiling, I do the other parts, it's okay. But the string wheel and even the handbrake and the armrest, it's going to wear, unfortunately. Hopefully it lasts 50, 60,000 miles. So let's just say two or three years. Um, so I think we'll be fine. I'm okay with that because I love it so much. And there's pros and cons to it. And that's why it's not in very many cars from the start. It's so beautiful. It looks amazing. And I love to feel the touch. But I'm gonna go get food. I can't decide what I want, whether it's Taco Bell, water burger, it's gonna be fast food. I'm gonna get it and leave. I need to get a few other things done today. But that was a quick mod I really wanna do since it's after Christmas. I'm still waiting on a specific part to get here before a kind of major, it's not necessarily a major, major modification, but it's a big modification. I'm very excited for it. It just hasn't arrived. I'm gonna be going to Vegas here pretty soon. And hopefully by the time I get to Vegas, the part will be back. And then from there, we'll have to work with a shop. I'm gonna have to take a lot of parts off this car and then I'll have to find a shop to do a powder coating. Let's just say powder coating. They're gonna have to powder coat. So if you have any recommendations in Tulsa, OKC, anything like that for powder coating, big objects, I would much appreciate that. In the meantime, let's go ahead and go get some food. And then after I go get food, whether I keep you along with me throughout the day or I put you down, this is the mod I really want to install today. I want to take you with me as I do it. So I'm going to go ahead and head out now. And I guess let's decide what I end up getting for food. Hmm. What should I get? <laughs> I did just make it back. Let's go ahead and I gotta eat. I really need to eat. So let's go ahead and just. Yeah, boy. All right, that was actually really good. I am full for the day. 
I do want to show you something else I actually got for the Mini Cooper. So Cameron was driving the Mini Cooper, of course, and he was driving down the highway. This actually happened to his friend not too long ago, but the hood scoop flew off of the hood. He was actually making fun of his friend that his flew off and then his flew off. It doesn't make sense because it's on the hood and it is pushing and the wind should be pushing on it. I don't understand how it fell off. Well, he's in a, in a situation where he's just investing into his business. He is just spending money on things that are a little bit more important. So I thought I'd get him a new scoop that we're going to have to paint for his Mini Cooper in the meantime. It's a little gift for all the help he's done for me. But I do have a new scoop for him right here. It's all primed up. Some bolts just fell out, snaps. But that will be getting installed in his Mini Cooper, whether we paint it, wrap it, or whatever we decide on. But that was my little gift to him. Other than that, it's not much going on here. I'm trying to decide. I'm gonna start editing this video just because I have a few minutes to spare. Go ahead and get going. I don't know if it's gonna be worth continuing as I don't have anything else for you guys, unfortunately. There's not much going on in Norman. It's a Sunday. So there's nothing like car related or really anything. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and start editing this video. And there I went to this car show, it's called Thursday Mega Meet. It was a while back, and because this video is kind of short, I may throw in a little clip of that. I didn't post it because the whole show, they have blast music and it's copyright to YouTube, so I can't post it. So I made it like a little quick. Here, you'll just see it. <clears throat> but if, if you guys wanna continue watching, go ahead and continue watching. Like and subscribe. This is gonna be the bonus video. I'll see you guys next Friday. All right, so I am at the car wash right now, and I was, I'm, I'm getting the car wash for a car show. Uh, it's Thursday, so the Thursday Mega Me. I'm gonna go ahead and get this video going. I'm gonna film a little bit of it. It may be boring. I may not even upload this, but if I do, uh, it's just because I'm playing around. I want to play around with the vlog styles. Uh, I, I'm about to upload a video pretty soon, and it's like part of this vlog. And I thought the video was way more interesting in my opinion. Once I upload it, let me know in the comments of what you liked. Did you like just the DIY videos or do you like me kind of taking along a little bit of my life every time I do a video for a car? But today I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to wash this thing up. It's 7.36. I'm going to be at work at 8 so I need a haul butt. And I'm going to get some Chick-fil-A, eat some breakfast. I've never tried Chick-fil-A's biscuits. Apparently they're delicious so I'm going to go do that. Uh, but after that... Man, I guess I'll just see you guys at the show or after the work. We'll just pick it up sometime. Hi right, guys. I thought it was gonna be early, but this has been going forever. There's so much traffic. I, it's already 5:52. It starts at six. I thought it was seven. It was it used to be seven, but I guess because it gets dark at like 5:30, they decided to move it down to six. So I thought it was gonna be super duper early. Turns out it may be super duper late because I'm still 30 minutes out or so traffic's really bad, so I don't know. I'm here at the show. I'm actually about to walk over. There's music playing. That's why I walked away, so you can go ahead. I'm gonna have to play music, uh, or, and you know, it's not allowed on YouTube. So I'm gonna go ahead and walk over there, and I'm gonna have to put my own music over it, but I'll show you all the cool cars here, and we'll, we'll talk about it in. But the whole thing about this is just to have you come along with me so I can show you all these cars. But here's OKC car scene.
Alright guys here, let's, let's get a little bit of light here. I'm actually heading home after all of that. Hopefully I got some good footage again. I, I wish I could just walk around with my camera and talk to you guys and tell you what I see and what I like. And I can't walk there because the music is so unbelievably loud half the time and all the good cars are. So, well, I'm heading home right now. So there's Jordan. So we're both on our way home and well, I hope you guys had a great day. This is me a random video. No, he's not doing anything. So we are heading home, uh, and I hope you guys are having a great week. I'll see you Friday.